Hi, my name is Chi. Welcome to my channel. You're watching Petite Dressing. When you're shopping for jeans, have you ever noticed some designers label it as petite jeans, while others may have short jeans? Did you ever wonder why? What is the difference between petite jeans versus short jeans? And which one is better for you? Petite jeans and short jeans are actually two concepts. A lot of us think they are the same thing. I know this may sound confusing to you. In today's video, I will cover the differences between short jeans versus petite jeans, and I will tell you which one is a better choice for you. Stay with me till the end. The answer might be surprising to you. Now let's get started. First, what is petite jeans? Petite size is made for women under five foot four. If you're in America, petite jeans, as suggested by the name, is petite size jeans. Some designers make petite size for women under five three, and other designers could make petite size for women under five foot five. But five foot four is a pretty common industry standard for petite size jeans. And typically, petite size jeans have two adjustments. When we think about measurements of jeans, the first thing that comes to your mind maybe is the size of the waist, because that's normally how we shop for our jeans. But size of the waist doesn't really matter whether you're petite or whether you wear regular jeans. So that is not one of the factors that should affect petite jeans. So what really matters? Number one is the most obvious one. That is the length of the jeans. And in the clothing industry, we call it the inseam. The inseam is the distance between the crotch of the jeans. And the hem of the jeans. The measurements of petite size jeans might be different for each brand. Some brands make inseam of 25 inches, 26 inches, but there are also brands petite size jeans of 29 or 30 inches of inseam. Number two, the rise. A lot of us are familiar with the length of jeans, but not necessarily with the rise of the jeans. So, what is a rise? It measures the distance between the crotch and the waist. Typically, a petite woman have shorter rise. That is why most petite jeans are adjusted to fit petite women. The rise of the jeans is an important factor that could determine how comfortable the jeans is on you. If the rise of the jeans is too long, you will not feel comfortable in them, and also they could make your torso look shorter. They will not look flattering on a short woman. If the rise of the jeans is too short, then you might feel like your midsection is cut off. So now that you understand what is petite size jeans, and the second question is what is short jeans? Short jeans are made by regular clothing brands, and they are not petite size. The only difference of short jeans. Versus other regular size jeans is that they're shorter in the length. Plenty of denim brands cut different leg lengths of their jeans to suit the needs of customers. Normally, it would be a short version and long version in addition to their regular length. I had talked about the two differences, the two adjustments that petite size jeans would make to fit women under five foot four. Short jeans will only make one adjustment, that is to make them shorter. So the inseam of the short jeans could be the same as the petite jeans. The short jeans are not adjusted for the rise. Here's a question: Is petite size jeans definitely better for you than short jeans? It might sound logical because petite size jeans are made for petite women, so they are obviously the best choice. The answer might be surprising to you. Most of the time, that is the case, but not always. It really depends on your body type. And here, I'm talking about the vertical body type. Yeah. 
Vertical body type essentially looks at where your waistline is and what is the proportion of your torso, rights, and legs in relation to one another. It will help you understand if you have short torso or long torso, if you have short rise, regular rise, or long rise. Normally, women with short torso and short rise are blessed with long legs. A typical example is Nicole Ritchie. Different vertical body type determines you need different rights of the genes. Understanding what vertical body type you have will help you find the genes that suits you. For instance, my vertical body type is longer rise and shorter inseam. So for me, actually, short genes may fit me better because I don't want the rise to be shorter. I am more comfortable if the rise is regular and of course, I do need this inseam to be shorter to fit my legs. So that is why, for me, short jeans is a pretty good choice. Here's another reason you should not rule out short jeans. There's a limited number of brands that make petite size jeans, but there's much more brands who cut a shorter size, especially the premium denim brands. Of course, petite women should always try on petite jeans, but you shouldn't be missing out on all the other great brands who carry short size jeans, which could work as well. Most of them do not cut a separate petite line, but they do carry shorter sizes. So I would encourage you to try on both short size jeans and petite size jeans. If you find this video helpful, give me a thumb up and subscribe to my channel. Leave me a comment and let me know which jeans fit you better. Take care, I will see you next week.